Hello, and welcome to another Games of Questionable Quality. I'm Dylan, this is my brother John, and his wife Katie. Today we are playing Shamu's Deep Sea Adventures. Uh, it's a game about Sea World where you kill your trainer. That was inappropriate. Let's get started! Do you want to play first? We've seen the beginning of this, because I just wanted to test out if it would be appropriate. How much trainer eating there is. Oh, sure. Uh, hard? Easy. Easy? Oh, yeah. Shamu and Horatio conclude another fantastic day at SeaWorld. I feel like we missed something. Learn how to use Shamu's animal behaviors. Pick up items, avoid sea mines, and break open sea chests. Listen closely to Horatio as he speaks through... There shouldn't be a comma there. As he speaks through SeaWorld's magical portal to communicate with Shamu. I think there's some major occult stuff happening here. Yeah. Like... Something about his eyes Welcome are creepy. Welcome to SeaWorld Adventure Park. I'm Horatio the Manatee, a vast show for the what, what is his full name? Horatio the Ageless Manatee is what he's Ageless referred to Ageless Manatee. The... He's beautiful. You, you will see the awesome picture of Shamu, the powerful and majestic killer whale. Now, the blue semicircle is your air, your oxygen, and just like the green bar, I can't think of anything funny to say. No, Sorry, this goes on for about 15 minutes. Okay. And have to start again. Remember to always try and keep your green and blue bars full. Does Shamu seem kind of small compared to Horatio? I mean, manatees are pretty are these, big. Are these the adventures of young Shamu? Maybe. This is like a prequel to real life. How long is the uh, is the lifespan of the average whale? Let's gurgle it. 50 to 80 Wonderful. years. Wow. Their sizes range from 23 to 32 feet. Holy cow. Cool. Cool. Horatio is pretty hip, despite his agelessness. Meat. It's pretty neat. This is your echo rumba, which sends out a loud killer whale call. Killer whale call? I hardly know her whale call. Watch out, this is going down. <laughs> <laughs> this just got so real so fast. <laughs> oh. Oh, did I beat him? You won. All right. 100% of it, too. Sweet. Swim away quickly. Flee from a Kraken to complete this mission. Uh, do I have to hold anything down? Just go to where it tells you. And okay, it. that's really hard because the controls are really... I want it to be like inverted, like flight controls. Big cobra fish! The thing you're going to learn here is that there's always, always a bigger, a bigger fish. fish. Yeah, that's that's the only one I got. It's not easy. There we go. There okay. Go. I just love how it's like, and you're done. I don't feel like watching this anymore. After showing off his strength, the Kraken holds Horatio in a cell. Isn't Horatio talking? Yes. Horatio speaks in the third person. It's one of his ageless powers. It sounds like they recorded him on a diaper. They use an underwater microphone, which isn't as good a quality. Because that's the real Horatio. A hole? Maybe the way to Horatio? I don't know. Maybe you could tell. Come, maybe you should come fight Horatio? Maybe Horatio will be a good person to hang out with? Oh, guys. Maybe we shall go and save Horatio. I'm gonna let you figure out. It doesn't tell you. It doesn't tell you what your goal is in these puzzles. So I'm gonna see if you can figure it out. It took me a little bit to figure out what yeah. they wanted me to do. Oh. Oh, and okay. How is Shamu right doing this? He only has. With his things. mind powers. Yes, boom. There they are. Hey. Oh. So let's talk about the controls. We move Shamu with the, uh, the analog stick, uh, and if we push the A button, then sometime later he will flap his tail. Sometime later? Yeah. <laughs> An undetermined ah, amount ah, of time. What is that fish doing? It's impossible. You eventually get this thing where the, the bad guys and your tail swings are like perfectly syncopated. This isn't very fun. No. No, it's not a, it's not a very fun game. So this is the exit. We'll see if it lets me beat the boss and leave this time. Is that the boss? Yep. I'm Are you attacking him? Is oh yeah, I am, crab? I'm tearing things up. What up? That's the end of the level right there. Um, but we can't, we need to go back to, and find the exit, which is where we're at. 
and collect crystals on our way. What it's not telling you is that there's a predetermined number of crystals it wants you to collect or you will not finish them. Tsunami! Do it! Suck it! Oh yeah! Oh, oh yeah! Mm. Mm. I Mop the floor! I tsunamied you, bitch. We're not gonna be able to use any of this. No! I'm gonna retweet your tweet. I'm new to Twitter. So. You hashtagged it no funnies. Oh, so I can't turn? I have no, to wait for it to... You, it's, it, you're, it's a rail line fish simulator. <laughs> <laughs> Miss... What? Didn't fit. It told me that it was completed, right? Oh. This game reminds me of a 13-year-old girl. Nothing makes her happy. You think if I hashtag SeaWorld in this, they'll like it on Instagram? Do, does SeaWorld have a... I don't know. They'll probably be like, why are you doing this to us? We thought we had gotten past that. Horatio was just learning to live again. I don't like playing this game. We've been playing for about 40 minutes. I say we call it. Yeah, let's I'm not call having it. A good this time. is it. This, uh, it is terrible. Time of death, no one cares. Thanks for joining us on another episode of Games of Questionable Quality. What was it about this game that sucked? Uh, it was repetitive, uh, it, the controls were sloppy and unresponsive, mm -hmm. uh... The game didn't quite communicate what it actually right. wanted you, never you to knew, do. <laughs> right, the objective would appear to be escape, but then it would actually be escape while collecting 30 crystals, mm -hmm. or chase this thing while collecting... So there or was solve always, a puzzle and you didn't know what the goal right, of the puzzle was. Right, it felt was. like the, it would tell you an objective and then it felt like they had tagged on those crystal count objectives afterwards. Mm -hmm. And the game would never tell you that you needed to get those. It was programmed in a lot of cases like a flight sim, but uh, the controls were not inverted. So join us next time when we play either Superman 64 or Mary-Kate and Ashley Sweet 16 License to Drive. Be sure to like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash 8worldsnews. Check out our blog, 8worldsnews.blogspot.com, and follow us on Twitter at 8worlds. Uh, and subscribe to this YouTube channel.